Healthy soils are a farmer's most valuable asset, driving productivity and profitability all over the world. Primary producers, farmer groups and government have been working together for over 70 years to improve the management of natural resources, including soil, to prevent erosion through wind and water runoff. In fact, leading farmers formed the Agricultural Bureau of South Australia in 1888 to help improve the knowledge of farmers and how they manage their land. Here, we take a look at what two South Australian farmers are doing to maintain soil health and the value they see in NRM and agriculture working together. A previous owner of the land told me that uh, they used to work uh, work this ground 11 times in a year and that was with horses so um, uh, it's no wonder the, uh, the surface of the soil ended up like talcum powder and the soil ended up hard as granite underneath. Uh, it lost all its porosity and it had packed down like cement so that when it rained the water ran off and caused this amazing um, guttering. Once we learnt that we've got to keep the stubble on the surface uh, the soil started to change and it changed reasonably quickly and in no time we could work the soil any time. It used to come up in big clods, big red clods. Uh, now any time you would work the soil it looks quite loamy. The, the carbon content of the soil has improved a lot. It's enormously gratifying uh, for me that, uh, that we've reached this situation. So the soils are very variable and very prone to uh, wind erosion uh, in this area. So, um, so we've had to manage that over a number of years. We tried to do it under minimal uh, tillage, but started to have uh, large issues with, uh, with wind erosion. So it was in the late 90s that we moved into no-till and stubble retention, and that had a, a huge improvement uh, in, um, in soil coverage and uh, a decrease in, in wind erosion. Our soils are, are really our biggest asset, so we've really got to manage them and look after them. And in this environment where they are very fragile, uh, we've had to um, spend a lot of time and effort into managing our soils to uh, eliminate uh, soil erosion. The, the interaction between ag and NRM is important to get uh, to get a balance between the environment and also sustainable food production. As government, part of our role is to monitor the condition of our soil and land in general. And we do know that soil erosion is one of our um, highest or biggest threats uh, to our soil. It has been for many years. So we do monitor the, the uh, protection um, of the soil from erosion and we do that by field surveys. You know, back 15 years was protected for about 276 days in the year, um, but now it's protected for, for 340. So that's a, just a dramatic improvement in just 15 years. The farmers have um, adopted much better practices for establishing crops and uh, grazing their livestock. Um, right across the state, so the adoption of reduced tillage and more recently no tillage with um, keeping stubbles has, um, has seen a dramatic improvement in the amount of protection on the soil throughout the year.